guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be coming back with another Mask Daddy tutorial. So this is gonna be our part two to this little mask moment or whatever. In today's tutorial, we're gonna learn how to achieve a very groomed masculine look in about 15 minutes. So if any of you guys out there wanna be polished and cute, you can do this in 15 minutes or less, for real. So I went all out too, like I, I edged up my beard, I um, prepped my skin, and gave myself a little sunburn or whatever, so. If you guys wanna see how to create this look, then just keep on watching. All right, so first we're gonna be taking my Philips razor and I'm going to be lining up my beard. I'm going to be taking the razor and just removing all of the excess hair that's working its way down my neck. A really good way to do this is to match your Adam's apple to the line that your jaw naturally creates to give a nice like edge. It just basically removes the shadow and gives you that really nice clean polished look. Pulling at the skin, just making sure I get that line nice and tight. You don't want a wonky line so just really make sure you pay attention to that a really good way to tell is to just kind of lean back and look at your line from with a mirror next i'm going to be taking this gardenia flower water and just spritzing my face hydration is definitely key when you're wanting to look really nice and natural so i'm going to literally drench my face with this and then taking my vaseline creme brulee chapstick which is bomb as fuck that's one kind of extra when i put it on next using my bare minerals complexion rescue this is a tinted moisturizer but it also has um, intense mineral water properties so it's going to hydrate the skin continuously throughout the day while giving you the really bright and beauty bomb look. And I'm gonna be taking my beauty blender and just kind of blending this out, having fun with it. No rhyme or reason here, just get it all nice and smooth. Next, taking my Bare Minerals Bare Skin Concealer in light, and I'm going to be highlighting kind of first, just to you know give me that more fuller coverage, but she still has like a natural moment. Putting this in all of my natural highlights, and this has a serum property to it as well. So this is going to be really hydrating and give a really nice glow to the skin. Like it basically is radiance in a bottle, bitch. And I'm just going to be taking my beauty sponge and just really precisely keeping it in the locations that I'm applying it. I'm not wanting to mesh this all over my face. Then taking the medium concealer and correcting my dark circles. I find that putting the darker concealer on second kind of helps to keep an actual highlight on the apple of your cheek and then the darker shade is going to neutralize and give you that more natural under eye. So next I'm going to be taking my Kat Von D translucent setting powder and I'm going to very lightly be dusting this under the eye. I want to keep a beautiful like luminous under eye. I'm going to go a little heavier on the powder on my forehead just because I have more prominent creasing there. Next, I'm gonna be taking my Rimmel Brow Gel, and it's just simple. You just wanna keep that on the hairs. Don't, kind of, don't let the product actually sit on the skin. You're just coating the hairs kind of like mascara. Next, I'm going to be taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit. This is the bronzers from the light and the medium, as you guys know. And I'm just going to be loosely bronzing my skin. There's going to be no rhyme or reason with this. I'm just kind of dusting it all over my contour spots. Now to break down all of that powder, I'm going to be going in with my Mario Badescu spray and going in immediately after with some highlights. So basically the high points of your cheeks, kind of put it on like blush and really bring it up to the temples. You're wanting to look as luminous as possible, like, like you've been working out. I feel like a boyish look, if you look sweaty, it looks more boyish, I don't know. And then next, I love to put a highlighter on my ears, my like the inner bridge of the nose. Now I'm going to be taking my Bare Minerals Golden Gay, and this is where I'm gonna give myself that sun-kissed look. So I'm going to be more so contouring with this blush. I'm wanting to really pack it on in my cheeks, really bring it up the cheekbones, on the apples, everywhere. Really work it in there like, a, like you would if you were to get sunburned. So it's a mixture between being flattered and burnt. And then I'm going to be working this all over the sides of my nose and a little bit on the bridge 
definitely down on the tip and just kind of blending that together just so the edges are nice and seamless and then going up right above where your brow bone is and a, a little below your contour spots going back in with more chapstick and that completes this look so stay tuned for my outro Awesome guys, so I hope you enjoyed this Mask Daddy tutorial. Super fast, super easy, super cute, super flirty, super fun! I love this look so much. This is actually the look that I've been wearing the most. Happy Pride Month also, guys. I got some fun Pride stuff coming your way next. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Give me some love if you guys want to see more masculine tutorials. This was a more basic one, but I honestly feel like this is like, you know, everybody wants to get their makeup done in 15 minutes. So, and this is not just for men. Like this is, this is honestly the cute, a cute as fuck look for anybody. Like you could pop on some lashes with this bitch and be darn. But it is all of the essentials that are going to last you all day and keep you nice and hydrated. So, thank you guys so much for watching this tutorial. My outro is probably a mess, but I'm excited for my products. But yeah, I love you guys so much and I'll talk to you soon. Bye. But, but yeah, so. You guys want to see how to create this? Um, yeah, um, but yeah, so. to clock you on where your blush is. I wanted to look a little sunburned. So we did. Oh, so yeah.